What is up guys and welcome back to my seven days that I play through. My name is the third red guy and thank you so much for joining with me today. So a couple little things I've done. I've adjusted the time again to make things a little bit more feasible for a one player kind of world. And then the other thing I've done is I went ahead and gave myself a little bit more time in the night just so like I, I set time back a little bit so I had some more time to do some things that I hadn't had time to do before. So, I was able to get myself, you know, just a couple of other small items, a couple other levels, and stuff like that, just so that I could kind of catch up to where I should be at this point, because it is already day four, and I'm worried. I'm very, very worried about how day seven is going to go. So, Look at that, perfect timing. So we're going to head over to Trader Joel's so I can turn in missions. What I really need to focus on doing for the next little bit is just cracking out as many missions as I can to get lots and lots of XP so that I'm going to be able to live because day seven is approaching and uh, I'm going to die if I, if I can't make some progress. <laughs> Alrighty, I could get a wood splitter mod, or uh, I'm not planning to do anything with that, so I'm going to grab the mod. And let's see what jobs you got. Oh gosh, it's so hard to read. Uh, that's not far at all. Let's do that. Super close. Okay, and then may I see your inventory? Let's see. Sell the old cash for coins. Alrighty. Does he have anything useful? Nope. Doesn't really have anything of value. So we're just going to head straight to this mission. And instead of clearing out the place for loot. And then resetting it and stuff. I'm, I'm just going to have to rush through these. I need to, to crank out as many missions as I possibly can. I also need to be getting meat, so I need to stop letting chickens pass me by like that. Oh, this is a tiny military camp. I'll clear this out really quick. Hey there, bud. Nice, nice. We just found ourselves a level 6 shovel, which is awesome. I think that's the highest level you can get items. So, that was a lucky find. I'm not sure how much digging I'm going to end up doing, but... Let's see, I'm pretty sure, yeah, I... Oh. I just repaired my scrap boots, apparently. I can scrap those. I didn't know that I could repair these. What does that use? Uses some of the iron? Okay. Well, let me... I'll do some replacing. Or some repairing, rather. Anything interesting here? Ooh, we got a lockpick. Those are good. Uh, bandages. Never a bad find. Okay, let's reset this point. Got a flashlight, that's nice. Oh, gotta reload it. This this crossbow is pretty great. I'm liking it. That's it? That was the only zombie? It's telling me to return to the trader now? Dang, okay, I'll take it. I will take that, dude. Alright, well, let's just finish looting this place up. All right, headed back to the trader now. I think maybe I should put those on my bar. And uh, I went ahead and put my point into getting higher quality tools now so I can make a two axe. 
And yeah, let's see uh, what he offers us as a reward now. Okay, we can get some 9 mil or some cooling mesh. Um, probably grab the 9 mil. Any submissions? Okay, if this one's the closest. I guess we'll go do that. Get a level up from that or no? Nope. Okay, we need to head to the west. 400 meters, ooh. Let's see where this is at. I think it's just across the way from our house. It is across the water, which I think I could technically go to the left and take that bridge over. I feel like it might be faster to just swim, maybe. Okay, I actually, before going here, I need to swim by the house and drop off some crap. Alrighty, we have offloaded all of our junk now, and it's time to make our way to this house. Should I... Should I go around? Is this gonna be faster? Yeah, it'll go faster. Or at least just crossing here. Hey, bud. It's getting stormy. You know, it's it's these first couple missions. Ooh, there's a chicken. Nice. It's these first couple missions that are the worst because you just kind of have to walk everywhere. But once we've got ourselves our bike. We'll be breezing through these missions. And that right there is a good amount of meat. And I've got some eggs, too. We just need to keep finding birds' nests, and I need to kill everything I see. Which, like, I've seen deer, and I've seen rabbits and chickens, and I've just let them go. And I need to stop doing that. Because right now I'm living off of canned foods I'm finding along the way. But that's not going to hold up forever. All right, and this is a supply retrieval. Yeah, we're just going to start this mission, too. Get out of here. What's up, boy? He just kind of showed up from outside, which is odd. Okay, we're back. It decided to have a little bit of hard time there for a second, but we're, we're back at it. We got some lockpicks out of that, so even though it almost crashed my game, it was worth getting. Okay, let's head in here. Oh, hey, there's what the item we need. Anything in the medicine cabinet? I got some painkillers. Well, technically speaking, that's all I need. I can leave now, but there's something in here. There's going to be zombies in here too, which I need to kill as many of those as I can right now because I need the XP. Come out here. Maybe go around the house. There we go. Here it is. This is the end stuff. Alright, just a zombie to deal with. This is what I'm looking for. Alright. Ammo, bullets. Got a sealed crate to crack open. Shamway, that usually means food. Ooh, I got an XP gain up. Very nice. Serrated blade mod, that's not bad either. Let's just eat that can real quick. 
Well, good looting that I got out of that. Let's uh, make our way back to the trader now. Now we're cooking with gas. All right, we've got the grave digger, which is good for that. Let's see, that's the same book you were offering me before, dude. I guess I'll take the grave digger. Got an AK I could buy. Ooh, I have enough to buy that too, but I have like very little ammo that I could use in it. Um, honestly, I'd rather have something that shoots 9 mil, because I've got plenty of that. You got anything interesting? Got an anvil. Hunting rifle. Ooh. I don't have enough for that, though. Dang. Uh, can't sell any of that. What do you like? Coal? What about bullet tips, huh? Two. Yeah, he won't buy like any of the stuff I've got. He will just buy the mod I got from him, but not for very much. Survivor, check back soon. I get new merchandise daily. Uh, let's put our. I guess we could put the serrated edge on it too. Why not? Alright, well, that wasn't very great. Oh, let's grab another mission, though. Any jobs? Let's see. Okay, let me turn my body so I can actually read this. There we go. It's got a fetch to the north of here. Yeah, we'll do that. Did I get a level from that, at least? Still no? Dang. He's being stingy with the, the XP. Alright. Let's go get ourselves... I think I only need to do a couple more missions and I'll have this bike. Okay, we're on our way to the mission. But there's a deer here and I wonder if I can get him killed with one hit. With the crossbow. Yeah! Nice! I will take that meat. 30 meat for that? Oh yeah. That's awesome. Very happy with that. Alright, I need to definitely be focusing on trying to kill deer when I can, because man, they give you a lot of meat. Oh, hey there, buddy. Oh. You're gonna run off before I can shoot you, huh? All right, well, at this mission, same deal. We are just gonna start this up and go for it. Or maybe, hmm, maybe I do run through this really quickly just cause killing things gives me a lot of XP. Maybe I should just run through, kill everything. Offer anything, oil. I only really need gas right now. Maybe I just run through and kill everything and grab the final loot, but don't worry about everything else. Oh, I've already looted this. Never mind. We'll get going on it. I guess we'll start with going down. Oh, I missed. The other one would have ended up in the wall. Looks like it got destroyed. I knew it. I could feel it. I could hear a guy still smacking around. Anything good in the fridge? No. Sink. Let me help you. Oh, there's our airdrop, too. I 
400 meters away. Alright, cool. You know, I forgot, this is a fetch. This isn't a kill everything. I need to find where that item is. Which it's telling me is like here. Uh, it's telling me it's below me, okay. Well, let's just finish going through this place and getting all the loot then. Okay, we got a Bunker Buster mod. Another bandage. Oh. Ouch. I gotta be like that, bro. Anybody else up there? No? Got a muzzle break. A pumpkin, huh? I guess we'll just eat that. And we got ourselves a lamb ration. I think we'll just eat that too. Well, well time to just find that item then, I guess. Is it this? No, oh, there's some coffee in it though. There it is. Alrighty. And do we have anything that I can just... I guess I'll move you there. And I guess we'll just put that on this guy, because it's the only place I can really use it right now. Alright. And let's head back to the trader and turn in another mission. Oh, and look at that. The the airdrop is, like, right by my house, which is awesome. All right, let's swing by the trader, grab another mission, and then we'll swing by my house to dump off crap, grab the airdrop. Many thanks. You okay. To be very I grab some shells or some 9 mil. Um... I think we'll take the nine. How many jobs? Man, he still is holding out on me. No matter what. Alright. We're gonna go do another mission, and this one's equally far away. I leveled up though. That's good. Alright, what are we gonna put it into? I'm thinking pack meal might not be a bad idea, just to get one point in it. Minor six to nine or though will make me have level 3 crafting tools. <sighs> I'm not sure. I could go put it... Faster aim, draw and reload speed, plus more damage. I think we're just gonna put it into archery. I can't wait till I get myself like a nice fancy compound bow of some sort. I cannot even explain how surprised I was when I was like, I can't wait to get a fancy crossbow. And there's literally one in the airdrop sitting right by my house. <laughs> <laughs> Cloth armor bundle. I'll probably just sell that. We got all these blocks to take apart. Man, I can't even explain how crazy that is. Okay. Uh, let's take you over there. And it's a level four, which is pretty decent. I think it means I can put like three different mods on it too. I'll take it. I've got one back on the house I can put it on too. Um, Put it over to the iron that I've got. I think I need to... Okay, no, it's unloaded. That's what I want. Man, I've got a nice iron or compound crossbow now. This is great. That's that's crazy. I, I hate myself for calling that out and then getting it. Because <laughs> it, it looks bad, but I promise, I promise. 
The game just decided to smile on me for once, although it's still giving me the f freaking 500 frames I have nothing to do with. Oh, and they stack in 500s? I've just got to scrap these at some point. They're full of wood. Okay, um, let's grab this guy, and now we can modify this and throw you on there as well. Okay, and I've got a pretty great ranged weapon now. So I'm happy about that. Alright, let me just put some crap back and I'll see you guys in a little bit. Alright, so this one is a fine buried treasure, which I realized I left my shovel back at the house. Is this going to take forever? Oh gosh, this is going to take forever. Oh... All right, but with a little bit of crafting, I just made myself a stone shovel so I can use this. This will work. So much better. Definitely would have been better to bring my iron one, but I can't leave. I forget. I'm pretty sure that the circle will get closed as I get closer to finding it or something like that. Getting closer, yeah, and then zombies spawn. I think they have a chance to spawn. Man, I will say this crossbow hasn't seemed to be giving me back the bolts nearly as much. I don't know if that's something to do with its power, or I don't know. Okay, found it. And this is the important thing I need. Blueberry seed recipe, I'll take that. And then we've got a couple other cans of soup. And some zombies are going to be coming in. Ooh. Okay, let's reload this. Reload this if I can. Oh, what the heck? I'm not sure how he just slipped down past where I could see, but okay. Okay, there we go. Alright. Not too bad. It looks like I broke my shovel, but that's, that's fine. I can just leave that here. I don't really need it. All right, time to make my way back to the trader again. We're getting a lot of missions in today. All right, no good rewards from the trader, but what I've discovered is that the benefits of taking off your armor just so you, when you're traveling are substantial. And I have this crossbow, which means I can kill most things from range really quickly. I don't really need to worry about being armored up because I'm not taking many hits at the moment. So I've taken off my armor and just going barefoot, and you can see how much further I can run without having to deal with running out of stamina. It's ridiculous. I wonder if I swim faster too, but... Okay, we are gonna cross over here. Yeah. Do I swim faster? Oh yeah, I swim faster, that's for sure. Alrighty, we've just started the mission here at this little diner. I went through and looted the place and I actually got myself a double pocket mod, which is great. That put that on my clothing. Now I have two extra inventory spaces. As you can see, without being over encumbered. And uh, this place has some pretty great piles of like food and such. So I am happy with this place. Let's just activate the key. That opens the door. Got a cooking pot, which I've already got one of those, but I'll take it. So you got a large food pile here. Ooh, 
Lots of good stuff. Fridge. Nothing great. I'll take the wood, why not? Um, I think I didn't check this. Yeah, cooler. And then here is what I'm looking for. Awesome. And then the only other thing to do is to crack this open and then go to the roof. And there'll be some stuff up there. Alright, let's just... Kill these guys real quick. Oops. That shoot person in front. Nope. Man, this thing is really eating through my bolts, you know that? Got some aloe. Got another book to read. Got a pipe baton. Is that gonna be better than my... Let's see, click on this and then highlight this. Slower swinging. Wait, I don't understand. I feel like it's probably better. Let's just put them side by side. Okay, 15. So when I highlight over it, it's telling me... Okay, it costs more stamina, but it swings faster. So the pipe baton swings slower, and it, but it costs less stamina. I'm gonna use that. Except I can't have the burning shaft mod, so never mind. I think I'll just stick with my club. And we'll just scrap you. Okay, and I am full of goodies. Like way too much stuff. Got a poppin' pills, which is pretty great. Ooh, that's awesome. I am completely full. <laughs> and need to run like 0.7 kilometers to get home. Ugh. This is gonna be difficult. I'm gonna need to condense some stuff. Alrighty, I did condense some stuff and got rid of some things, but then I also realized that even if I took off my armor, it's making me technically more encumbered, but I still lose less stamina. So this is going to be faster to run home this way, and you can see I'm making good time, so we should be fine. We're going to make it back to the trader because he should still be open by the time we get there, and hopefully that gives us the last mission. And then we can get our bike, and we'll have to worry less and less about this whole stamina and travel situation. Alright, we have made it. Okay. You have... I guess I'll take the 762. Alright, here we go. And I'm getting a level up. Now, I can already make a forge. And then everything else is useless. I definitely want a bicycle. We're gonna see your inventory. And I should be able to sell this. No, I can't they sell the bundle? Alright, well, I guess I'm gonna... open it. And then I'll sell everything individually, that's fine. And there's the last piece, okay. We've got ourselves a bicycle, that's what's important. And we are able to get a lot more coins. Is there anything that's that great to have that would be worth having? AK isn't bad, but it's only level 2. Ooh, I could buy eggs. So I can go make some more bacon and eggs. That's not a bad idea. What does this do? Nope, not worth it. I get the hunting rifle. It's level 3. Ah... Uh, and it shoots 7.62, which I've now got a good amount of. I've got some more at home, too. Eh, that might be worth doing. I'm not going to worry about it right now, though. Come back now. Ooh, and now let's ask him, you got any special jobs? Yes, let's open up trade routes to a different trader. Alrighty. It's ooh, it is quite a ways away, but that's, that's okay, because I now have... 
something that I can't place down. I have a bike. And I think I move the same speed on a bike regardless of being encumbered. Or overweight. Sweet. Well, this is going to change the game, man. Being able to move around a lot quicker. Ugh, wonderful. I cannot believe... And here's the thing. This is one whole part that I've done today. And it's lasted from 5 in the morning until now. You can see how much I've extended the time to give myself. Because I got to day 4 within one part. That's how fast time was going by. I got screwed over by that. Honestly, I should be giving myself a lot more time than I did. But you know what? I'm going to push myself a little bit and we'll... You know. We'll just we'll keep it how it is. And if I suffer for it, then I suffer for it, you know. At least I will be suffering for your entertainment. Yeah, I gotta finish, figure out this food situation because I've got way too many different types of food, so it's just taking up so much space in my inventory. Did I level up? Great. There we go. Been eyeballing that. Okay, now I can come over here. We're gonna add our coal. And then we're going to make ourselves bacon and eggs. Takes two eggs for it, five meat. All right, that's fine. All righty, we've got bacon and eggs cooking now, which is great. We'll carry that on me for food at the moment. That and I think the sham chowder, just cause it gives so much stuff, this will last me for a while. So I think all the cans we're just gonna store for now. Those aren't cans, that's a medication of some type. What is this? Fort Bites? Uh, okay, I guess I'll just put that in there. And the meat stew. Alrighty. Um... And we've got bacon and eggs now. Which I'm then immediately going to put away, because I've got these sham chowders to get through. Okay! Well, I think we're going to go ahead and just call that apart. Ending with getting the bicycle is pretty great. Super happy about that. I'm going to have to get, like, a red dye off of something at some point, just to put it on my bike. But we can now travel longer distances in a lot less time. And I think next part we're going to start out by heading to that other trader. Uh, so that we can unlock that. So, yeah. We're going to call it here. Hey, thanks again for watching, guys. And I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day.